The Ghana Chamber of Telecommunications, which confirmed the blockage in a media statement, says its members, Airtel to go, MTN and Vodafone, will start deactivating SIMs from Wednesday, November 30. Now, consumers would virtually lose the usefulness of their SIM cards, except the data it holds. Now, services that would be blocked include voice as well as data, now data from mobile phones, MiFi's and other data providing devices. You also lose SMS, including incoming and outgoing SMS's. USSD will also be affected, as well as mobile money services and emergency services. Well, it is critical to note that this is not affecting only phone users, but any SIM device which has only done one stage of the SIM registration. The Wednesday, November 30 statement seems to be the last as the Ministry of Communications and Digitalization's directive was issued on November 11, 2022. Now, you recall that since the 20th of November 2022, some telcos have been blocking data services for all subscribers who have only had one stage completed that is linking to the Ghana card, but not the stage two, which requires the uh, full biometric process of the SIM card as directed by the ministry. For TV3 News, Imano Samani.